All right, let's take a live look outside. Cooler lately with some May gray mornings. Danny Roberti is standing by with our next weather forecast, but isn't she special? Oh my goodness, I love her, Pat. <laughs> I just want to hug her. Oh my goodness. And the fact that she can still get out there and she's moving and grooving and dancing. Oh yeah, but she yeah. said be just a little happy. Yeah, exactly. And all the hard things. Mm -hmm. Find the happiness. <laughs> That's right. I love that. That's so inspiring. And we are going to find the sunshine in the May Gray Pat. So we are going to talk about it. For some of us, it was tough to see the sunshine today. This is a live look from our Mount Wilson camera. And you can still see areas in the San Gabriel Valley just socked in with the clouds right now. But some of us, we did see some of that sunshine. Here's a look at our satellite radar. And it gives you a good idea where we still see some of those clouds. So areas like downtown Los Angeles, you're clearing out just a little bit right now. I'll zoom you in St. Gabriel Valley still socked in right now. South Bay area areas like Long Beach and then for most of Orange County really stretching from Huntington Beach all the way down to San Clemente. It's been a cloudy day you guys, but when we're dealing with these clouds, it keeps us a little bit cooler and that May gray. It is here to stay. We are used to it this time of the year though, uh, so it's going to be kind of the pattern over the next week at least. So we will see some areas of morning drizzle early in the morning. We'll get some late day sunshine and then for some of us, it is going to be warm and breezy, especially across the desert. I mean, it was toasty today and it is still blustery in some areas that includes Palmdale into Victorville. Palmdale, you're seeing gusts up to 36 miles per hour right now, and it's also pretty breezy through Lancaster into the Santa Clarita Valley. So let's jump to the timing of the clouds. I want to let you know when we can see some sunshine going into the next several days. So waking up tomorrow morning, we do it all over again, you guys. So it's going to be a gray, cloudy, kind of foggy start. And you can see that eight o'clock for all of us, these clouds extending into the valleys, into the inland Empire. Look what happens as we go into about 1045 Inland Empire. We're going to start clearing out. We'll get some sunshine still cloudy in our valleys and for downtown Los Angeles and Orange County. We get to one o'clock and we'll start to see clearing for our valley communities. Downtown LA still holding on to some of those clouds. It is going to be socked in for most folks uh, in Orange County uh, right there along the beaches. But late in the day tomorrow, it looks like we might be able to squeeze a little bit of sunshine out for uh, Orange County and for some of our beach communities. Now Saturday morning gets here. All eyes on the weekend. It's going to be quiet this weekend, but we're going to continue to see this May gray. That's the case 815 Saturday morning, and we're even going to notice a chance for some light drizzle. So don't be surprised if you need to use the windshield wipers. It'll be early on in the day, though. So once we get to 1030 again, Inland Empire, we're going to be the first ones to clear out. Still cloudy for our valley communities. 1130. So late morning gets here on Saturday. We start clearing out. We're going to start to see some of that sunshine still cloudy in the South Bay into downtown Los Angeles, and then we'll start to see some sunshine later on in the day for our Saturday. Tomorrow, highs feeling very similar to today. We're talking 60s for the beaches into downtown Los Angeles, some 80s in the Inland Empire, 81 right there. But it's going to be warm and breezy in our desert communities, nearing 90 again going into tomorrow. LA Orange County, we are going to stay in the low 70s this weekend, and you stay pretty close to that early next week, cooling a bit by next Thursday. So things are going to be quiet, calm, mid 70s in the valleys this weekend. And in the IE, Pat, we're talking upper 70s for our Saturday and Sunday. So cloud in the morning time, sunshine in the afternoon. Things just staying kind of quiet going into the next couple days. LA, you can now catch CBS Mornings from 4 to 6. And if you didn't catch us then, we're back from 7 to 9. Four hours of CBS Mornings from 4 to 6 and 7 to 9. Everything your morning should be. KCAL News, now weekday mornings from 4 to 11. CBS News Los Angeles, your local news, streaming wherever, whenever.